Hi, I'm Nancy Cutie, I'm 22 years old, I play for Welsh Feathers and I'm English, Welsh and Nigerian. So I was first introduced to netball when I was in secondary school, just playing in PE. Um, but at the start I played tennis as well, so netball was kind of just like what I did in school. And then I joined a club and it wasn't until I was in year 11 that I made the decision to kind of put tennis to one side and take up netball as my main sport when I joined county. And then it's kind of just been upwards from there and then I started playing at uni and now I'm with the My proudest achievement is definitely getting my first cap feathers at the World Cup. It was it was crazy, it was the opening game of the World Cup against the home team, so that was definitely the highlight. Um, my proudest achievement, yeah. yeah. Since I've started playing netball, there's been like a steady increase in the number of black women I've seen play netball anyway. Um, and like being feeling and being represented does make a huge difference. I remember when I used to train, Back in my MPL days, it went with Team Bath. I used to always see, I always talk about it, but I used to always see Ebony or Zora Brown playing. And seeing someone who looked like me and like kind of encompassed all the things I wanted to be when I grew up um, really makes a difference. And like that show just shows how important feeling represented is. And in saying that, five of the top 10 teams in the world in that ball are made up of primarily non white and like mostly black athletes. So it feels really incredible to be um, like part of that, of that top 10 with those teams and feel represented amongst netball players. So I think just doing what we're doing at the moment will attract more young like black girls to join netball, you know, showcasing the sport and showcasing the diversity we have within the sport. When I was at the World Cup, I had a girl from Swansea message me who said that seeing me play at the World Cup, someone who looked like her really inspired her and I think that was a bit of a circle, you know, like full circle moment because when I was younger, watching players like Ebenezer or Brown um, train at Bath, that really inspired me to kind of continue playing and like she was someone I looked at and related to. So I think just offering opportunities for people who are of like minorities to kind of be shown and like showcase will play a big part in encouraging young black girls to join them. I think it's tricky to balance showcasing what you want to showcase and what you need to showcase, but like the reality is there are fewer black athletes playing sports, um, like in Wales especially, so like netball and all those other ones. So I think it's really important to just give them a platform to discuss all things sports, um, discuss their experiences, give, give advice to young athletes who are in similar situations because a lot of people who are like a minority have experienced a lot of similar, a lot of similar things and therefore I just think it's really important to give them a chance to like talk to younger athletes and like just discuss their experiences and I think that's it and it's honestly just a great start to be honest. Mm -hmm.